a line of cars moves steadily forward to get into the event, people without tickets try to get a glimpse of the action. Officials say arrival times for guests are staggered, and they all have instructions for where to park. It was all right. It took us about five minutes to get through. It was pretty smooth up to there. Traffic wasn't terrible. It was way better than I expected. Officials with Travis County say they don't anticipate any major delays on State Highway 130. There won't be any changes to normal traffic flow on the roads. Lots of people who don't have tickets came early, hoping they might have a chance to get in. From what could be seen on the outside, the massive factory and parking lots, some lights, and people setting up for the event. One person hoping to get in says he thinks a couple thousand people will show up who don't have tickets. Well, the hope is that after some time, they'll be a little bit more relaxed about letting people in and we'll just hang out until then. There's going to be a long line. I need to be one of those first few people in that line because let's say they have a permit for 15,000 people and 500 leave. I want to be that first 500 people at that gate to make sure that I can get in and, and see this factory. Others want to share their love for the company by giving out t-shirts. I've been up since 6 o'clock this morning trying to get here as fast as I can with this wind and hold on to my hat before the wind takes it away. I hope that the wind would take me with my suitcases away to the other side of the field so I can give all these to people for love of Elon, for God's sake.